Hey, what up, y'all? So, um, I got my uh, Turo Beast back a little while ago, and I just had a little time to go ahead and try to program it again. I just soldered up some uh, a patch cable so I don't um, have to cut off my other wire. But uh, here we go. Better plug it up. There we go. This is USB connected to PC. Cool. Go ahead and uh, turn on the uh, the app. And uh, so the preset is to test. So uh, go ahead and rename that. Now we got forward break, forward break in reverse. Reverse speed, 25%, that's good. Voltage cutoff, 9.6, that's good. BEC power level, I'm gonna go ahead and crank that bad boy up. And uh, let's see, overheat protection, I'll leave it like that. Alrighty, so what else we got? Throttle control, punch rate stage one, stage two. Uh, let's see. I'm not gonna mess with none of that. Brake control, drag brake, 10%. Brake strength, I'm gonna go ahead and put that up to uh, 80%. Oops. 80%. Let's see, initial brake, uh, 15%. What else is on this page? Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and leave all that. Save. Data storage mode. Uh, let's do the voltage current, throttle, RPM, and ESC temp. Definitely want this. So uh, this is, I guess, where you uh, view the uh, data log. I haven't done any runs on it yet, so uh, whenever I do, I'll go ahead and uh, post that too. Now go to firmware, firmware version, hardware version. And over here at the program box. Update my program box. So uh, that was basically a little walkthrough of uh, everything that you can change through the uh, PC link. We're well, using the SkyRC program box as a uh, PC link. So this here is the uh, wire that comes with the uh, Sky RC Toro Beast. And uh, it has the uh, eight millimeter bullet connectors on both sides. And what I did was this time, I didn't alter it or cut it off. I just like left them on. And uh, I don't know if uh, any, any of y'all have the uh, Castle 2028 motor, but it comes with extra female eight millimeter connectors. So what I did was I just soldered those onto a wire and I have the uh, Kessel 6.5 polarized connector on here so I hook up my wire harness or battery or whatever. So it's basically a little patch cable added on to the uh, stock wire, well, stock wire, but the wire that is supplied with the uh, SkyRC Toro Beast. So uh, that's what I did for the uh, wire part because all my RCs run Kessel 6.5 millimeter polarized connectors. Thanks for watching, y'all.